Hey there! In this video, we're diving into everything you need to know about OBD2 trouble code P0440, also known as EVAP system malfunction. First things first, let's break down what the P0440 code actually is. This code gets triggered when the ECU detects a condition in the EVAP control system that indicates a fuel vapor leak or a lack of purge flow in the system. In simple terms, the system is either not sealing properly or failing to contain fuel vapors, which means the EVAP system isn't working as it should. That means a large leak in the fuel vapor containment system. Now let's talk about the EVAP system. The purpose of the EVAP system is simple but vital. It's designed to prevent fuel vapors from escaping into the atmosphere, which helps reduce air pollution. Basically, it's a collection of components that create a sealed environment, capturing, storing, and eventually purging volatile fuel vapors from the fuel system. When the engine is off, fuel vapors are stored in the charcoal canister instead of being released into the atmosphere. Once the engine is running and the conditions are right, the purge valve opens. This allows those stored vapors to flow into the engine, where they're burned during the normal combustion process. If you want to read more about any other OBD2 codes, you can visit our website obdcode.org for a full list of codes and their meanings. Now let's learn why P0440 gets triggered. To ensure that the EVAP system is functioning properly, the ECU performs routine fuel vapor leak tests. These tests can happen when your vehicle is parked or while it's running. Here's how it works. The ECM sends a signal to close the vent valve and the purge control valve. This seals the system and allows the ECM to monitor it for any pressure changes, if the car is parked, or vacuum loss, if the car is running. If the ECM detects a drop in pressure or vacuum that exceeds acceptable limits, it assumes there's a leak somewhere in the EVAP system. Depending on the size of the leak, the ECM stores a specific code. A large leak is recorded as P0440. Now that we understand what P0440 means and how it gets triggered, let's cover how to reset it. Sometimes error codes like P0440 appear due to recent maintenance or temporary glitches, and they may clear up after an OBD2 reset. To do this, you'll need an OBD2 scanner. If you don't have one, check out the link in the description for the best scanners out there. Simply connect the scanner to your vehicle, follow the instructions to clear the trouble codes, and see if the P0440 code reappears. If the P0440 code reappears, it's time to look into some common root causes of P0440. Let's discuss some common root causes of the P0440 error code. The first cause is gas cap issues. Your gas cap could be missing, left open, or just not secured properly. Even worse, it might be faulty or damaged, which can compromise the sealed system. The next cause is cracked or damaged fuel tank. A cracked or damaged fuel tank can allow vapors to escape, leading to the P0440 code. The third cause is faulty fuel tank pressure sensor. The fuel tank pressure sensor plays a big role in monitoring the EVAP system. If it's faulty, it might falsely trigger the code. The fourth cause is cracked or damaged charcoal canister. The charcoal canister, which stores fuel vapors, can crack or get damaged over time. This creates a leak in the system. The fifth cause is a disconnected, cracked, or punctured EVAP hoses. EVAP hoses and clamps are another common point of failure. They might be disconnected, cracked, or even punctured. The sixth cause is a faulty EVAP vent solenoid. The EVAP vent, which allows fresh air into the system, can fail and cause a leak. The seventh cause is a faulty EVAP purge valve. Lastly, the purge valve, responsible for sending vapors to the engine, might be the culprit if it's not functioning correctly.